welcome back to Booster Therapy, your cure for that pack cracking addiction. We are back once again, surprise, surprise, with a mystery, a mystery booster. And this is uh, going to be a box full of mana crypts. I can just feel it deep down inside. It's got to be true. And it's, of course, another special box. Why is it a special box? Because it's a sponsored box, which means one of our patrons was generous enough to buy a box and have it open here on the channel. And our patron of the day here for today is Mr. Zach H. Zach, good luck to you and thank you, sir. So we'll bust right into it here. A couple quick ways you can help support us. Uh, you can check out the details in the description. Just click that little drop down and it'll drop down and show you the link to our Patreon, some other links, including uh, our TCG player link. Otherwise, you can just hit that like button if you like the video, subscribe, share with your friends, and uh, make sure you hit that notification bell so you don't miss a video. And here we go. Let's jump right into it, folks. So thanks for uh, thanks for popping in. All right. Tectonic Edge, Contagion Clasp, The Trading Post, and Form of the Dragon. An oldie but goodie. Gotta love the Form of the Dragon. So thank you again to Zach. Man, I hope we can get you just the, the juiciest of boxes. I really do. Oh, Sarah's Embrace. That's a Cool old card. Oh, the Gurmag angl Angler. That's a card that's been reprinted a, a time or two. Ash Barons, Impending Disaster. And Shamanic Revelation. I believe that was uh, probably a few years back. How long has it been since we uh, had the old Ugin set? It's been a little bit. And the Harmonic Sliver. It's a good uh, foil uncommon there. The slivers are always something to be desired. Yeah, Fate Reforged was an, was an interesting set. Definitely a lot of potential value in that. And the Blue Elemental Blast. Again, another just useful card. Singer Vampire. All right, here we go. Let's get it going here. All right. Oh, Belby's Portal. Nissa, Voice of Zendikar for a Mythic. And the Stigma Lasher. Wither and they can't gain life if you smack them in the face for the rest of the game. It's a pretty cool little ability there. In the old school uh, mono red decks. I don't think it's being run anymore. It's just not probably efficient enough, but it was definitely a good card. Mind Rot. Snake Umbra. I do like the Umbras. And Krufix, God of Horizons. Man, I just hit this in a previous box. And Teferi's Protection. Well done, sir. Into the Knowledge Pool for our foil. Beautiful, though, in the uh, Teferi's Protection. That is an absolute amazing card that you want to hit. So you are off to a fantastic start here. I am very, very pleased with how this has started off. See if we can keep it going. The Grave Digger. Goblin Assault. Thought Erasure. Ghost on Verge. To the Karen Wanderer. And Boros Reckoner. And another duplication. It's real. The Stigma Lasher is going to be hidden in the back. Yeah, they uh, they have randomized the crap out of these, so you truly never know what you're going to get. You could get a double mana crypt. It's been done before on this very channel. Costly plunder. And a nice little charm. Cthodian. Angelic Destiny for another mythic. And the Living Death. With the Foil Stormcrow. This is where Brett would just uh, rip that baby up right on camera for you. I will not. I will not rip the stone so you got to respect the birds. It was once in bird law, so you definitely got to respect them. All right, here we go. Brainstorm. It's a good card. The Flunkies. Oh, we're in a goblin pack here. Come on, baby. Show me that mana crypt. Oh, the Bloom Tender. Wow, you were hitting some nice rares. And the Muir Entity. With a nice little, uh, nice little ranger in the back with flash, very nice. Scribe ranger. Wowie, wowie! You have hit some 
beautiful, beautiful rares so far. Bloom Tender and Teferi's Protection, outstandingly done. Molten Rain, blow them up. Well Wisher, I've got to include it for you. It's a staple of my old elf decks. You're definitely getting that whether you want it or not. A Thieving Magpie. Ooh, and the Debtor's Knell. It's actually a really cool card. Beginning of your upkeep, put target creature card from a graveyard onto the battlefield under your control. Expensive mana, but it's a really sweet card. And with a mana weft sliver. More sliver fun. All right, we are um, just beyond the first stack here, and so far we are off to an excellent start. So very, very well done for Mr. Zack. All right, Zack. Blanchwood Armor, Lay of the Land, Benthic into Recoup, and the Phyrexian Plague Lord with a Springjack Shepherd. Kind of a whatever pack there, forgettable pack. That's okay, this next one's going to be good. This is the Mana Crypt pack. They always put extra Mana Crypts in these packs. Phyrexian Rager, Mog Fanatic. Dismal Backwater, the Aura Shards, very nice. With the Corsair of Crufix, beautiful. And the Boundless Realms. It's an expensive mana cost, but a pretty cool card. Alright, Zach, I see what you're playing at here. You're trying to get a Mr. Monster box with the Mother of Ruins right off the bat. Oh, that elusive Demonic Tutor still... Still eludes us to this day. A lot of ramp in this package here. Prism. The Dungrove Elder. Chromatic Lantern. An absolute commander staple. And the Intruder Alarm. Creatures don't untap whenever a creature comes into play. Untap all creatures. You can do a lot of combos with that. A lot of mean combos. Come on, Mana Crypt. You know what? Come on, Silvala. I haven't opened a Silvala in quite a while. Alright. Crop Rotation. Gotta include that. It's just a fun card. Familiar. River Boa. Island Walk. And Animar. Soul of Elements. With the Teferi's Puzzle Box. I am very happy with that pack. Very solid. Animar is, if you haven't played an Animar deck, it is very, very fun. I would highly recommend you put one together. Spreading Rot. All right, the Crystal Chimes. Oh, and a Time Sieve. That's also a good card. With the Beastmaster Ascension. Man, the cards are just so good in here. And Mirrodin's Core. There's just so many good cards you can get out of these. It's just, it's still mind-blowing. As many boxes as I've, as I've opened, it's just kind of blows me away. Counterspell. Absorb this. Ooh. Monastery uh, Swift Spear. I didn't even know that was in here. Plummet. Simic Locket. And Chatter of the Squirrel. With an Adorned Pouncer. Play your cat decks. And the Spring Jack Shepherd. Once again. It's back for more, the Spring Jack. All right, I want some more heavy hitters. I want the Silvala. I want the Expropriate. I want the Mana Crypt. Ooh, I also want the Animate Dead. Nice. Get in there, Animate Dead. Hooting Mandrels. Crumbling Necropolis. The Questing Feldegriff. And Mycloth. With a Morrow. Just a big old Morrow hidden in the back. All right, last pack of the second stack. Um, so far, again, I think very solid box. Very, very solid. All right. Still waiting on that Mana Crypt, though. I want it. Fountain of Renewal. The Energy Field. Were of Invention. With... Geth's Grimoire, an evil book, an artifact book of evil. All right, let's get that expropriate. Let's get it going. Let's command it to come out. 
maybe one day we'll hit it again. You know, you just never know. Mindstone. Enchanted Evening, one of my favorite, uh, nope, I put that in the wrong pile. One of my favorite evil cards that you can put into a deck. And the Torment of Hailfire, another sweet card. With a with a legendary human warrior. It is a rare. Norin. Big old Norin. 2-1. Comes comes back non-stop. Right. I'm getting a little uh, a little antsy here. I do want the mana crypt. Gush. It's a very solid card as well. Alright. Woo! One of Brett's favorites, the Wild Mongrel. Put some of these cards off to the side here. Fires of Yavamaya. The Short Sword. And the Cargan Dragonlord for a Mythic. Into the Eldrazi Monument for another Mythic. And Mirrodin's Core. Man, I liked that pack. I like it in multiple Mythics. I'm not sure where the price is at the moment. You'll see it on the screen for Eldrazi Monument, but... That card is a absolutely fantastic card. A highly recommended card. If you're going any kind of go wide strategy and uh, being able to replenish your guys is really pretty sweet. New Benalia, Shrouded Lore. And how about Mama this one? How about an Elish Norn? Beautiful. I don't think I've opened a single Elish Norn. I've opened. God, I don't know, about 10 boxes? I don't think I've hit one of these yet. Well, I'm glad I did. And the Sundial of the Infinite. Very nice. All right. Elish Norn, I don't know where that sits these days, but I don't think it's cheap. It's definitely one of the top hits I know um, in Iconic Masters, so can't be bad. Dream Twist. Come on. Farseek, that's a good one. That's a keeper. Volunteer Reserves, you're getting that one. And release the Gremlins. Beautiful. With another Geth's Grimoire. Strange. Alright, just a handful of packs left here. Can we get some additional goodies here in the close? Boy, I hope so. I always hope for more. A little Krenko action. Bloodbraid Elf. Meteorite, Viashino Sandstalker, and Recruiter of the Guard. Wow, well played. With the Grand Architect in the back. Wow, what an outstanding pack that was. Just excellent. Absolutely outstanding. Well, I am very pleased with this box so far. Always hoping for more, but very, very pleased. Oh, weird. Core Chant. Another Green Belt Rampager. And a Fungusaur. A nice little Fungusaur in the back. Well, we've got two packs left here for you, Zach. Good luck in the close. And if you're still sticking around with us here, thanks for sticking around. Hopefully it's making your day a little bit better. Just to be able to enjoy some packs and kick back and relax. Our fire. Ooh. Glory and Skarg the Rage Pits with the Corrupted Conscience and the Rune Scar Demon with an Echoing Decay. Nice uh, creature removal there. All right, last pack for the Zack attack. Good luck to you, sir. As we see if we can get you a Mana Crypt or a Demonic Tutor here in the close. Well, no Demonic Tutor. Knight's Whisper, though. That's a good one. Takedown. Adventurous Impulse. Come on, now. Ooh, Maelstrom Archangel. The one that should be legendary. And Fimblethip the Lost with... Ooh, a Triskillian. Foil Rare is your final Foil Rare. Well, once again, I think you, you did pretty good. Um, I'm pretty happy about that. I hope you... Uh, enjoyed the video and uh we got a lot more to come here folks so stick around um man we got a lot more brett's still got about a hundred thousand mystery booster boxes so 
Get excited for it. And until next time, folks, this has been Booster Therapy. Thank you.